on, two times two. This can't be so hard. Ooh, I also need to memorize this. Ah, Sammy. Our kitchen is full of dirty dishes. It's your turn today to clean up. I totally forgot. I'm sorry, let me finish here and I'll do it. So where was I? Huh? Hello? Sam, where are you? Oops, Roger, I forgot. What? But you promised to help me. Sorry. Ooh, I am so happy we decided to take a break and go to see a movie. A movie? What are you talking about? Don't tell me you forgot about that too. You promised me. Sorry, Sue. I'm very busy right now. We will go some other time, okay? We need to do something. I have a great craft idea that will help you remember everything. Firstly, we are going to need some cardboard and colorful paints. Even though it's an organizing craft, it doesn't have to look boring. Am I right? Sounds good. Sue, have you seen my textbook? I completely forgot where I'd put it. Ugh. What is this doing here? Susan, is this yours? Oh, right about time. This is exactly what I need. I can squeeze lots of acrylic paint in here. Um, Sue, what exactly are you up to? This looks quite weird. Trust me, Sammy, you're going to like it so much. I promise. We need to make sure that the paint inside the baggie is fully covering the cardboard. Watch me! Now let's fix everything with some scotch tape. It has to be sturdy in order not to slip. Voila! This is what you should get in the end. I don't get it. This is just a piece of cardboard in a baggie full of paint. It's not like that, Sam. Check it out. You can draw on it. Wow! Is that some kind of magic? I simply have to try this. This is so cool. I love it. Thank you, Sue. I'm happy that you like it, Sammy. But that's not all. Seriously? There's something else? Then let's move on. I like your enthusiasm. To proceed, we need more cardboard. I can do that. Don't go anywhere. Hello? Do you hear me? Buy cheap. Sell high. We need more cardboard. This is epic! They will call me the Cardboard King! Ah! I'm okay. It's good to hear that, and thank you for all of this. Let's come up with a shape for our future craft. We'll make a half circle on top. It is important that our drawing board doesn't fall out, so let's leave some extra space at the edges. Sue, so I brought you a special ruler! Great! Now we can easily make several openings. We are going to need them. It's time for some magic! Whoosh! Ha <laughs> ha! Awesome! Now let's take the base and transfer our template. I know some magic too. Oh, these look quite boring. I know, we can paint them. Did someone say boring and paint? Yeah, would you have a look, Monsieur Magnifique? What color should we use? Well, well, well. You need something not boring and bright. Why pick one if we can use all of them? Um, what are you talking about? We will make our craft colorful. All done. Well, what do you say? It's awesome, but why do we need the openings? To look through them? Here we'll have poppets. Let me show you how to make them. Oh yes, I love poppets. <laughs> Yay. This time we need our ruler, a ball, and foam paper. Wow, that's what I call a great hair day. Sue! Do you want to deal with your hair or make a poppet, Sam? Yeah, you're right. I really want this poppet, but at what cost? Now using this ball will make the pieces. Foam paper should be hot enough to keep the right shape. Let's cut it out, but don't forget to leave some extra foam paper edges. Like this! It's gonna be huge! <laughs> oh yeah, we did great! But it would be even better if we made them colorful. Let's paint each one of these according to the colors that we have on our base. Oh, 
Let me guess. Next, we need to glue them to the cardboard. Right you are. Do you work part-time as a fortune teller, Sam? <laughs> yeah, every Thursday after school. Does the letter M mean anything to you? Quack! Mama? Yes, yes, I see. Your mom says hi to you. She misses you so much. What? But she's standing right there. Give my money back, you fraudster. I see you're making good money on your hobby. Anyway, let's get back to our craft. We'll glue this piece at the front part. Now comes a big moment. We need to fix the drawing board really good. And cover it with the second base part. I'm back! Do you need help? Well, we need ear templates. Your order is here, miss! I made everything by myself! Thanks, Sam. The golden part goes inside. And we simply glue them on top. Looks cute, right? This goes here. Uh-huh. Look, Sue, I made the unicorn horn. Awesome! Here we go! These two poppets can become a pair of eyes. We only need to work them up a bit. Let's not forget about the mouth. I also have another cool decoration idea. Let's make our poppet a cute little bow. Here are the pieces. already have the material. The color choice is just perfect. Yes, I like it very much too. So first, we'll make the outline. I want to do it. Where is my pencil? Oh, thanks. <laughs> okay. Be careful, Sam. You can do it. Uh, Sammy, can you speed up a little? Patience is a virtue, Sue. What's more important, quality or speed? And I'm done, Sue. Finally, let's move on. Hop. Ah, this looks great. Let's fix it here. I love it, Sue. I mean it. It's a perfect spot for the bow. Hooray! Hmm, I thought you said it would help me remember everything. Don't worry, Sammy. We are not done yet. We're at the most important stage now. Let's add some sparkle to it. I know how you like shiny things. See? Now you can write all your notes here! Wow! Practical and shiny! Just how I like it. It's perfect. But I still have to test it. Sue, there's no more free space left. What shall we do? Don't be silly, Sammy. We can easily erase everything and use the board again. That's great and everything, but we'll waste so many tissues like that. Then let's upgrade our marker. Oh, yes, and I already have an idea. Here, a perfect colored cardboard for a perfect craft. I also like this teal color so much. It's so refreshing. Welcome to our show about the wild yarn. Psst. Friends, here we have a rare pink yarn species. It's such a rare occasion that it allowed us to come up so close. Oh, look at that! Our pink yarn just had a baby! What? You want to be a pom-pom on our marker? Is that your dream? Well, go ahead. Great! You're going right here. Now it's a lot more practical. <laughs> we also need a place to keep our marker safe. Awesome! It's exactly what I need. I always lose my stationery. Sue, help me here! Like this! Oh, there we go! We're such a great team! Now I will show how to make a pom-pom in detail. So watch closely! First, we need to wind the yarn of different colors around the hand. Like this! Now we'll put it on the table and tie it up. Do it really tight so the threads don't come out later. The next step is to cut the yarn in half. You will get some kind of a messy pom-pom like this. I need the scissors again. Sam, do you know why I'm doing this? To remove the extra threads from the pom-pom. It's like cutting the wool. Exactly. And voila, it's like we got it from a shop. But how will you attach it to our craft? Easy peasy. Watch me, Sam. We sew the pom-pom like this, but don't forget to secure it with a knot. Now we can attach it to our craft using a thread and a needle. All done! Our cute craft is completed!
Man Sam, you know it. I need to distract myself. Where's our craft? What to draw? Oh, I know. Phew, I'm exhausted. Then just squish those eyes. I mean, that pop it. I feel much better now. So, did you remember to do everything that you planned? Oh, yeah. It's cool that I wrote it down. I watched, I watched the dishes, dishes even, though even though I didn't, I didn't like, like it. Then we played D&D and, D and, D and, D and, D and we lost, lost as always. And later, and later we went, we to, went the to the movies with Sue. with Sue. It was a great day. Friends, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Bye-bye. See you in our new videos. We love you. Bye. School's officially over. And I've got big plans for my break. Ha! I love this show. Whee! Yay! Sam. Sammy? Wake up. What's wrong, Sue? School's about to start. You slept through the entire break. Are you kidding me? Uh, my bag is empty. I can't go to school with no supplies. I'm staying home, Sue. It's okay, Sammy. I'll help you. We can make the coolest school supplies ever. I was hoping you'd say that. Let's get started. We're going to need to keep everything organized. Aha! I know what to do. We can make you a special pencil organizer. First, I'll need to cut this foam in half. I'll use this hair straightener to soften a piece of foam paper. Uh, can you hurry up with those straighteners? This humidity is messing with my hair. Sorry, Sammy, it's all yours now. And this is going to be the base of our pencil organizer. Uh, I love the feeling of the wind in my hair. Pretend you didn't see that. Whoopsie! Now we need more foam paper to wrap it around. I don't think long hair suits me. I prefer the bald look. Uh, and I'll continue with the organizer. Next, I need to make small openings. Hey! That looks like a sneaker! You got it right. That's exactly what it is. I hope it smells better than my sneakers. Huh? Oh, Sammy. <laughs> it looks good. And it smells good, too. I'm glad you like it. Mint, just what I need. Wait a second. I think I can use this. I'll keep the candy for later. Well, this will make a great pencil sharpener. Now, I'll glue a popsicle stick to it. We had popsicles? And you didn't tell me? Huh? Um, Raj ate them all. Just wait until I see Raj. He knows I love popsicles. Uh, can we get back to the craft? I want this to look like it's melting. There we go! Hmm, I'm hungry. Uh -huh. And I'm smart, Candy. <laughs> ah, refreshing. <laughs> Did it get cold in here? <laughs> Every popsicle needs sprinkles. They make everything better. I want this to be super cute, just like Sam. Sue, I kind of got stuck. Do something. Um. It works perfectly. Wait. Sammy, are you okay? Here, this will warm you up. Whoa! Where did this guy come from? Whee! Uh, Sam, you need to keep things tidy. I have a unique system. I know where all my things are. <laughs> Hang on. This gives me an idea. Ha! Come on, show me what you got! I'm gonna need some more tubes. Check this out. Looks like a masterpiece to me. I love it. It's like a crayon sleeping bag. I'm pretty jealous. <laughs> this will keep everything secure and stop the crayons from falling out. I was right. This is really comfortable. Hmm. I'm getting sleepy. And this heart is the finishing touch. It looks great, isn't it? Do you like it, Sam? Sam, hey, wake up. Did you forget about school? Uh, I was hoping you'd forget about that. Nice try, Sammy. Um, you need to go. And you know that. Do I? Really? But school is boring. I know. But school is important and we still have a lot to do. I guess you're right. How is that going to make math class fun? You'll see. Just keep watching. Where's your notebook? We just need some glue. 
I love popping bubble wrap. All done, Sammy. Anytime you feel bored in class, just press this. It'll make your day better. You need to do the same with my other notebooks now. Why didn't I think of that before? It's genius. <laughs> I think that's all you need, Sammy. You don't want to be late for school. No, no, Sue. We have more paper left. Just one more craft? Pretty please. All right, but you better really help me with all the pieces. You can count on me. I'm at your service. <laughs> Friends, this time we'll be using really thick colored paper. And this piece goes right here. Shouldn't we tell the viewers exactly what this is going to be? <laughs> what do you think? Oh, you're right, Sammy. This will be a pencil case. You can store markers in it this way. Whoosh! Awesome, right? By the way, this part of the case should be able to kind of stand like this. So, we need to glue this tiny piece right over here. Great! And the other half of the pencil case will be slightly different. Holy cannoli, she does that fast! Let's add decorations to the inner part of the case. Fabulous. Friends, do you like it as much as I do? Whoa, Sammy, when did you do that? I can't reveal my secrets, Sue. <laughs> Ooh, mysterious. I'll attach a strap to close the case. Perfect. This is just what Sammy needs. anything. So do you have any idea what it is? Maybe it's a brooch? Did you forget we're making school supplies today? Not accessories. Sue, don't keep us in suspense. It's the cutest paper clip ever. Pay attention that you need to attach a clip to the fabric, not just put it in. Let's make it look even better. I want to add some sprinkles. Our star will look like an actual cupcake. Way! Did someone say cupcake? Oh, Sammy, I can see you have nothing to do. I wish someone could make another paper clip. Sue, why do you need someone when you have a slime like me? Haha, <laughs> it's so easy to trick you into crafting. And you, friends, can ask an adult to help you with this stage if you want. In the last touch, I haven't heard Sammy for ages. Where is he? Sammy? I'm here, with another paper clip. Oh, wow. Would you look at these cuties? Let's try them out. They can also make great bookmarks. Sam will never lose these cute little buddies. I really like all of them. We're gonna need more bookmarks. <laughs> Come on, Sue. You can do it. Why do I feel like I'm back at school? Next, we need these teddy bears. You'd be surprised how easy this craft is. You can draw any animal you want. By the way, Sammy? Yeah? I'm here. <laughs> 
You've said something about your drawings. I think it's time to show off your art skills. I can do it even with my eyes closed. We will see. Oh, and one more thing. Can you please keep the bear theme so the bookmarks are in one style? I'm sure you'll make a cool bear. There are so many of them. Friends, we need to make two openings here. But don't forget about being very careful while working with the cutter. Sue, try and guess what bear I'm making. Hmm. Let me think for a bit. According to the white wool color, it could be the polar bear. Am I right? No. Uh, but you're lucky to have one more guess. Sammy, maybe you can just show us what you've got there. The panda. Friends, give us a thumbs up if you guessed that right. <laughs> I think we're done here. Let's look at all our bears. under control, Sammy. Stop panicking. Let's make it nice and sparkly, then. Your wish is my command. Yay! We need to figure out how to close our unusual binder. This time, instead of Velcro, we'll use magnets. Here we go. Looking good. How long should I wait for you, Sue? I'm already done. It looks like you've enjoyed making this. Check out this cute little raccoon. Let's give him his paws. One goes here. And another one goes right here, like this. Now we can close our binder. Wow! If the binder is closed, it seems like our raccoon is closing his eyes. Yep, it's like he's playing hide and seek. Phew! I'll see you later, Susie. I've got all my supplies. Nothing can stop me from getting straight A's. Have a good school day. What a day! Oh, what happened to the straight-A student? Uh -huh. One step at a time, Sue. Let's not rush things. <sighs> it must have been a tough day. Let's let him sleep a bit. Bye-bye, dear friends. See you soon. <laughs> oh, hey, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Samantha, oh, I'm sorry, Wednesday, can you lend me an orange marker? Hmm, there's nothing here that looks like an orange marker. Oh, well, okay, I'll take another one. You're moving! Uh, ouch! <sighs> By the way, what kind of school supplies may Wednesday have, huh? Hey! Well, let's find it out right now. Great idea, sis. Hey, hey, wait for me! Oh, hi, all! Well, where do we start? With markers, of course. Huh? Whoa! Are they gonna be so big? <laughs> there sure are! Uh, whoa! <laughs> wow, well, wow, well, looks like you've decided to play big! Go ahead, give a thumbs up! We'll take a bottle and a cup to make the writing end of the marker. Carefully cut it out, like this. Up. Now we're gonna fix this with some hot glue, and then we'll take a couple of… Styrofoam circles. We'll close both ends of our large cardboard tube with them. And a smaller pipe like an excellent cap for… <laughs> huh? Gotcha! Uh -oh. Oh, let's add some plastic to make it sturdier. Haha, <laughs> you can't catch a smart slime like me! <laughs> <laughs> nice move, Sammy. Just what we needed. The cap of the marker usually has this holder. We'll just round it up. Uh-huh. In the meantime, I'll finish the base of my marker. This decor piece goes to this hand. Let's start painting. Yours will be black and mine will be pink. We're getting started. Here you go. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, that's better. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, who are you? Where's my little sister? Oh, wait, what? Okay. Shiver me, Cheddars. Even I can do that. Let's make our markers rideable. Roll up a neat ball from felt and wool like this. Then we'll dip it in turns in liquid soap. And in water. Hey, I said it turns. Yeah, stop it, you naughty hand. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> splash, splash. <laughs> See, I'm startling <laughs> around. Give it to me. Crafting hey. is not finished yet. And whoosh. Oh, I said whoosh. Uh-huh, that's better. Now I'm all set to continue. Hey, I want to do that too. Come on. Hop. Huh? Sammy. <laughs> Some saucers you are. 
Okay, I'll do everything by hand. Let's turn this ball into a cylinder. Can I have a bottle cap? You got it! Uh huh, gotcha. We'll make a wide hole in the lid and glue this ring into its place. In the meantime, I'll finish the cap. Let's make a stopper by gluing a stick for the glue gun inside. And now it's time to refill our markers. Let's get to it. Woohoo! Prompt a fairy to the rescue! <laughs> what are you gonna prompt? The fairy will not help those in doubt. Soon coming to you. Whatever. Tell me now. Oh, oh. Stupid props. <laughs> Tell the good fairy what hmm. would you like. I wish for some. Hmm. Uh -huh. Got it. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> Do you like this version? Oh, it's so cute. Thanks, fairy Sammy. I'll just add one tiny detail on my own. And I'd had fun without any fairies. Huh, I love bats. There can be too many of them. Just like there can be too many rainbows. Am Ooh. I right? Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, and now let's check what these giant markers are capable of. We can make these markers even more awesome, you know? Alex has a. You are in big trouble, mister! Guys, I didn't mean to! I'll fix everything! We'll tape you so that you won't interfere. Oh, come on! Yeah, I don't like when this happens either. Oh, come on, you! <laughs> Guess it's free! Listen, let's make a giant tape. Yes, but it has to be Wednesday style. Cut out the desired shape from cardboard. Glue it around from both sides. Uh-huh. Ouch! This looks like a fence around a cemetery. <laughs> huh? See, we need another piece no. like this. Hey, since when are you in charge? And why not? I still have a bunch of things to paint. I'll do it! You know how much I love to paint! Sammy! <laughs> Friends, while our Sams are arguing, I came up with something. Even if this craft should be spooky, doesn't mean it can be bright. Hmm, not bad. Although I still would like to add this. Well, I can't even imagine the size of the spider that makes such a big... <laughs> And we're at the finish line. It remains to put all the pieces together. <laughs> Good luck finding a duct tape that big. We <laughs> don't need it. Let's replace it with bubble wrap. Mix it with double-sided tape. And here's the last piece. Cool. And relaxing. Ah, oh, no more bubbles here. Let's get rid of it. <laughs> oh, I forgot which Enid-style craft I wanted to make next. Oh, you. Couldn't you have written it down on sticky notes? Of course, and they're so bright. Let's make them much bigger, though. <laughs> Cruller, pencil. <laughs> Let's cut the sheets of foam paper into several identical strips. Hey, you took the rainbow apart. Now we'll arrange these pieces into neat piles. Great. And now with a glue stick, we'll glue them together like this. Hey, hey, where are you going, Pink? We <laughs> don't need this little crap. Oh, look, here's a reminder for you, friends. Take a large sheet of transparent plastic. One, two, three, four, five. And the giant sticky notes are ready. Ew, it's like someone threw up with a rainbow. At least they're noticeable. Oh, yeah, let's check it hey. out. <laughs> Very funny, Sam. <laughs> Guys, we'll be back in a second. Oh, this is great. Hmm, let's see. Uh-huh. If we make it like this, then... <gasps> oh! Ew! What have you done? <laughs> You've been pranked, Susie! Oh, you and your pranks. Oh, come on, sis. It's just gooish. It comes off easily. Oh, really? Well, let's get you dirty, too, then. Huh? Have you used up all the paint? Come on. Then I'll make my own gooish and you will beg me to share with you. Let's pour some clear glue into a bowl of cornstarch and then paint it. Then let's mix everything thoroughly until you get a slime mess. Oh, what a cool thing! Well done, Susie! Okay, once Sam gets my forgiveness. <laughs> well, I'll help you crap then. Tell me what to do next. We need to mix the washing gel into our mask. And knead it like dough. Ooh, I love it! Now put our slime here. Pink Samantha, close the lid tightly so that it doesn't dry out. Well, does it look like gooish? Hey, but where are the other colors? Huh? Wow! Boom! <laughs> we'll make the packaging from a large sheet of colored paper with a hard bottom and secure it with double-sided tape. Looks kind of 
plain, though. Hmm. Check out what I've got, Sue. A conciliatory label. Well, I no longer hold grudges for that prank. So, truce. Oh. Hey. hey, did you forget about me? Uh, we couldn't even if we wanted to. So, Sue, will you let me play with this? Pick a color. So, we have three Enid style crafts and only two Wednesday style. Oh, I can see that. We need to make one more. <laughs> and I already know what. A pen with a sweet surprise. Sam, make a cone out of the pie, please. Your wish is my command. Watch your fingers, folks. Great. Now we'll glue the black crayon inside and cover the whole thing with shiny cardboard. Oh, sweet cookies. It looks like a tip of a pen. Bingo! Only we'll have it with a secret. Hence this container. Let's close the junction with a decorative element. And here's the other end of the pan. It also needs decor. Leave it to me, sis. Oh, let's go. Uh-huh. Well, it's rather Enid style. <laughs> wow, finally! How cool is that, Sam? All I have to add is a clip. <laughs> I'm gonna eat Not you now. now. Sammy, this hey! is the main feature of our pan. Huh? And twist it tightly. Amazing. Mm, I love spooky candy. <laughs> You. Okay, okay, here we go. Fair now, three rainbow crafts and three black ones. What crafts did you like best? Give a thumbs up for Wednesday style. And subscribe for Enid. Thanks for being with us. Yeah, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs> welcome to Sam's Wheel of Fortune show. Let's welcome our contestants. On the right side, we have sweet, smart, and with amazing taste, Susan. On the left side, brave, resolute, and with a great sense of humor, Samantha. Today we'll find out who of the two girls is better versed in magic. Let's go! And we're getting started. Spin, spin, all the wheel. And our first question is, what is the most magical creature? Ah, the contestants have made their minds. And... Susan, your answer? This is the easiest question. Of course it's a unicorn. And that's the right... Hey! What? what what's the matter? Well, everyone in the world knows that the most magical creature is a mermaid. Where'd you get that from? I know it. This isn't right. It unicorn. is. Unicorn. Passion grand high. There's only mermaid. one way to find out who's right. <laughs> the crafter's competition. <sighs> for how long should I wait? I wonder if I'll get extra points for being on time. Calm down, don't panic. I'm already here. Wow, it seems that someone decided to become a horn wing horse. <laughs> I believe that the magic of the most magical creature will help me today. And we'll check this in our first task to transform the riding object. The team of unicorns represented by Sue chose a simple pan to work with. A couple more minutes and it won't be so simple anymore. <laughs> We'll glue on some mini pom-poms to cover the junction. And Samantha, who is a fan of mermaids, decided to transform a marker. Oh, just look how beautiful this is. Hop, hop. <laughs> you can have as much fun as you want. Let's take some self-hardening clay and shape it into a unicorn horn. And now with a toothpick, we'll make a relief. Just a few diagonal recesses. Okay, it's time for me to get down to business. Great! I'm gonna glue a larger piece of fabric onto the marker itself, like this. And a smaller one will go into the cap. The main thing is not to make a mistake in the sizes. In the meantime, the unicorn team has got into acrylic paint. There's no magical unicorn without a golden horn, right? It remains only to attach a couple of beauty ears. And give an extra gloss to the entire pen with… Huh? Where is it? Sam, what are you doing? What? Did you just try to sabotage me? Give it back. <laughs> oh, please. I'm almost done here anyway. I just need to draw a beautiful flipper and attach it to the marker. Uh-huh. We'll cut out two identical parts from shiny foam paper. And now we'll glue them together like this. And attach the whole thing onto the marker cap. All done! Hmm, that's a brilliant idea about a foam paper. I will make a cool fairy name for my unicorn from it. 
Awesome, let me see. <laughs> Nay. <laughs> then I'll check out what you've got. Wow, look how shiny it is. The both contestants hope for the first deck perfectly well. Let's see what else is waiting for them. Stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Our next shiver me cheddars, what's happening? Let me help you. Hold this, Sam. Yeah, what a mess. It's clearly impossible to do without a special organizer here. Let's roll out the air plasticin. It turned out great! And stick it around a regular duct tape dispenser. We'll smooth out all the bumps. Sue loves horses with one horn, but I'd rather prefer seahorses. And that's it. You're good to go. Ugh, thank you. And what is your rival doing there? Mm -hmm. Isn't it clear? It's Seahorse's tail, of course. Let's roll it like this. Interesting. And now we can stick it in place. Just press it well. It already looks good. Hmm, but something's missing. Bright sequins will be emitting scales and give a magical glow to our seahorse. Wow, what a beauty! Hands Ouch! Off. Easy! When the air plasticine hardens, we'll give our seahorse a pearly glow. And then fix it on top with clear nail polish. This is a wonder, ladies and gentlemen! But how does that work? Simple. We tear off the required amount of adhesive tape. And voila! Amazing! Ten points to Gryffindor! Uh, I mean mermaids! <laughs> it's very beautiful indeed, but it holds only one piece of tape. Now we're talking. This time, let's make our unicorn soft pink. It's the best color. <laughs> Second up to the judge, Susan. Smart. Oh, please. To highlight some of the details, let's apply nail polish to them. And then add magical golden dust. Perfect. It's time to assemble our construction. And now the main trick. Whoosh! It's so beautiful! <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah. what sound does a seahorse make? Nay! <laughs> Again, we've got two great crafts! It's time to toughen our competition! Our contestants have already received their next step to make bookmarks. But this time, Sue will be working on a mermaid craft. Mm, no, that doesn't look very good. And this is not either. Mm, yes, let's stop on this one. Now we need to carefully cut out the mermaid's tail according to the stencil. And send it into the oven. Sam, could you? Oh yeah, give it to me. I'll do it all by myself. In the meantime, I'll take care of the scales. We'll also cut them out of clay using a plastic straw. It's simple. Let's give the fin a more natural look. And then bake and paint everything again. Look what I found! Oh, cool! Why, thank you! <laughs> That's how easily the former rivals become assistants to each other! Let's add some more glitter. Oh, I love this so much! We'll glue the tail to a cute drawing and get the most convenient bookmark. I wouldn't jump to conclusions, sis. You haven't seen what I've come up with yet. <laughs> of course, unicorns are not my cup of tea, but I know for sure that where they are, there is a rainbow. Mine will be unusual. Just check out how it shines. <laughs> Foam paper and that's it? I got a lot more creative with your bookmark. Oh, did you get your impatience from Sam? I beg your pardon! Oh, <laughs> sorry, Mr. Show Host. <laughs> what? Now let's draw the tassel like this to make a cute tail. And attach a pair of chubby legs. Don't forget about relief. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Oh, how much I love crabs that unite. Now we'll add some gold to the hose with acrylic paint. And give the whole unicorn a mysterious, fabulous glow with nail polish. So, are you all ready for the final touch? So let's go! Pop! And everything is ready! Here oh, you wow. go, Sue. Thank you. <laughs> ladies, ladies, what are you doing to me? How should I choose a winner here? Oh, thanks, Tippy Dub. I never run out of crafting ideas in my head. Here. 
So, why do you need a foil ball, Sam? Well, you heard our next task, to make a cute pencil stand. I will make mine in the shape of a seashell. This'll be the base. And now we need to thoroughly knead this pink clay. Uh, 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 uh. Well, we'll be working with the clay too, only wearing gloves. To begin with, let's make a shape of a rainbow, roll up a plump sausage. That's it, great! And bend it into an arch. And now we need to make a few holes for pencils and pens. This clay rainbow will soon set and be ready to be painted. In the meantime, Samantha makes… a super long worm or something? It's not a worm, see for yourself! I'll now carefully wrap the foil frame. Gently in a spiral and along the entire length. Here's what we should get. But real seashells are not smooth at all. Let's do this and then set it into the oven. While Samantha is fiddling with the relief for her shell, I'll brighten up my stationary rainbow. <laughs> That's a cool name, right? <laughs> I think your craft is missing something, Sue. Really? Hmm, I wonder why. <laughs> well, now I have time to overtake her. Bit of mermaid magic. Awesome. And some pearl glitter on top. I'm using a dry brush for this. Samantha's words haunted Sue, but she already knows what her craft's missing. <gasps> Air clouds. They look just perfect here. Let's work a little on their shape. Like this. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, this in my opinion turned out just great. And everything is at hand. <laughs> but your stand can compare to mine. This one fits more stuff. Samantha one, two, zero. <laughs> well, mine can stand on the table, unlike yours. What did you say? No. Please, please. Yeah. I'm the judge here, and I made my decision. We need a final round. All right, it's time for today's most dangerous competition. Sue, Samantha, and the scissors. The unicorn team chose clay as their main crafting material. Unicorn scissors, it's a dream. Look what a cutie. Aha, this time Susan makes a winged creature, not bad. We need to let the clay harden well, and then we can turn on our fantasy. Highlight the eyes and nostrils with a black marker and our handsome buddy is ready! The unicorn team did it in a blink of an eye! And how are the mermaids doing? Apparently this time, Samantha chose some non-standard crafting approach! The Vaseline will keep the scissors from sticking to the parchment because I'll work with a glue gun! Don't use it without adult supervision, friends. And just like that, the handle of the scissors takes the shape of a fin. I've seen a lot of things in my life, but I'm definitely seeing this for the first time! Don't forget to cut the glue right here so that the scissors could open. Let's work on the shape of the fin. Melt it with a heated tool. And now we'll cover the glue with, uh, white glue. What? Are you sure you didn't make a mistake? Well, how else should I decorate it? You're asking me? It's your craft. Let's see what comes out of it. Now it's time to shine. <laughs> it's definitely impossible to overdo this. Oh, this is heaven. <clears throat> That's it. It turns out great, mermaid. And the final touch, acrylic varnish. Holy cannoli, yours. Which scissors do you like more? Give a thumbs up for the mermaids and subscribe for the unicorns. And now the judges retire to count the points and you can recollect everything we did today.
wait to know the results of the competition. Well, I can't wait to fail it, Susie. <laughs> okay, ladies, I've made my decision. Today, the winner is... Pink Slick Slime! What? What difference does it make if I get the new stationery? <laughs> oh, yeah? Oh, you asked for it. Whoosh. Whoosh. What's happening? <laughs> A tail? A horn? Come on! Guys, we hope you had as much fun today as we did. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so you won't miss our new videos. Bye-bye! Hey, where did you go? Did you forget about me? Bye-bye, <laughs> folks! Sam, Sam! It's so cold. No one was expecting that snowstorm. I'm never going out there again. I'm sure I saw a polar bear. Have some cocoa. It'll warm you up. I wish I had time. I have so much homework to do. with snow. <laughs> mm, this might take a while to defrost. I'll go get the hair dryer. I really need those pens. Not so fast, Sammy. I have an idea. And it's really cool. Let's go. A cool idea? Then I'm in. We're going to make a desk organizer to help you with your homework, Sammy. Here I've marked out the folding lines to keep working with the cardboard. Whoa! It looks pretty good. Can't wait to see the result. Then I'll keep going. Great job. Now we need to make some cuts. And I'm speeding up. Could you grab a glue, Sammy? Already on it, Sue. Thank you. That's why we make a great team. It's like we can finish each other's... Sandwiches! Wait, that's not what you meant, is it? <laughs> No, and anyway, where's my sandwich? Fine, you can make it later. We need to fold these pieces of cardboard. It's actually really easy. Look! Hey, this is like an accordion. Yeah, I suppose it is. Ah, uh, Paris, I miss it so much. The Seine, the Eiffel Tower, ah. Uh. Don't forget the pastries, Sam, they're yummy. Croissants and all that, you know. <sighs> this talk is making me hungry. I need to focus. I've got more cardboard, Sue. Watch out! Just like I planned. Everything was under control, but I have no idea how you did that. Although I'm not complaining. Now we need to close it over. I got it! Whoa! It's fighting back, Sue! Hey, you did it, Sammy. Nice work. I'm just happy I could help. What's next? We'll need drawers to store your ribbons and string in. I have no idea what you're talking about. I have a unique filing system in place. <laughs> Are you completely sure about that, Sammy? Hmm, now that you've mentioned it, it might be a little outdated. Well, this thing I'm working on will solve everything. We need to cut this cardboard out and then we can start assembling it. All done. Sam the Builder is here to help! Alrighty, let's see. Check this out, Sue. Why, thank you. This is great. I suppose it was a tough one. How much do I owe you, Mr. Builder? We need a few more of these. I'm way ahead of you, Sue. Take your cardboard boxes. And they're all just for a hug today. Wow, Sam, that saved us so much time. Builder Sam, no job is too big or too small for us. Call now for a free cardboard, I mean quote. Wow, that sounded like an interesting offer. I didn't know that you're doing advertisements now. Well, yeah. To start a business, you have to get your name out there. And another part of the organizer is complete. I really like how it came out. Aren't you forgetting something? You still have to pay. I'll happily hug you, Sammy. <laughs> Ugh, I've got so much homework to do. Where do I start? Okay, you can do this, Sam. Concentrate. Are you okay, Sammy? I'm not going to lie, Sue. I've been better. Ouch, thanks. Let's make something to store all these notes. 
I think that's probably a good idea. Oh, I'm feeling like I just waxed off my eyebrows. <laughs> well, looking good isn't easy, Sammy. Hmm, can you cut a hole in the top of this piece? And I will make more boxes. Of course, Sue. Anything's better than dealing with homework. <laughs> All done! Nice try, Sammy. You still need to do your homework. Let's see if it works. Huh? It's the perfect fit. Now we need to glue these all together. Be careful and don't glue your fingers to the boxes. Whoa! It's like a Jenga tower! Let's play! Not just yet, Sammy. We're kind of busy here, remember? And it's not a board game. It's for your sticky notes. I think it looks great. What on earth? Hey, Sammy, what are you doing? Sorry, Sue. I've got too many stationery. Don't know where to put it. I think I can help with that. We just need something to hold them together. And this shiny buddy will help us. Now let's fold it carefully, like this. Strange. I was following your lead, but I still made something different. Now we need to make some more boxes. Here we go. I think that's enough. Yay! Now I can put my markers inside. Here, give it a try. There you go. And here's one more. Sue, so, can you maybe do my homework for me? No way. I'm not falling for that again. Oh. Little pink slime have so much homework. Uh oh. Avalanche! Save me, Sue. Sammy, are you okay? Uh, I thought I was a goner. Thanks, Sue. We need to make something to keep all your paperwork neat, and I know just what to do. Voila! I knew it could count on you, Sue. We need to fold this in half, just like a pizza box. I wish there was pizza in there. We need some glue, Sammy. Can you do the honors? Well, of course! I'm always here to help! All done, Susie! <laughs> You're like a gluing machine! You never let me down! And I love working with you together! I don't think that will hold all of my paperwork! You're right! We need a few more! Also, let's make them more sturdy. This cardboard should do the job. We'll have to put a piece inside the wallet. I can do this. This needs a delicate slime touch. I'm done with mine. Well done. I couldn't have done it better myself. And this is the last piece. We've got everything we need for the organizer. Ready to do this, Sammy? It's going to be so much fun. Just like playing with puzzles. I love jigsaw puzzles, Susan, and you know it. So I'm in. Let's do this. I think you'll like this one. Look. What would I do without you, Sue? You're always there for me. Here we go. Great. This will definitely help you with your schoolwork. And this piece needs to go into the paper wallet. Now, we need a fastener. Hmm, where's the Velcro? Velcro? I haven't seen any Velcro. <laughs> oh, Sammy! I want to add some practical decor. And something for the marker holder, too. There we go. I'm glad, but it's not finished yet. But what else is there to do? Well, the cold weather sort of inspired me, you know? Whoa! You know that Elsa's my favorite snow princess! I knew you would like it. Now check this out. No more messy ribbons. These are my 
favorite stickers. Could you put them inside too? With pleasure. Oh, Sammy, this organizer is to keep things tidy. One last thing. And that's it. Sam's snow-themed organizer is complete. Homework time. Ah, I knew you were going to say that. Let's get this over with. So warm and cozy. <laughs> well, I'll see you later, Sue. Another school day awaits. <laughs> Sammy, you can't go out in that weather. You'll freeze. Oh, sweet Susan. It's okay. The cold won't bother me. What? What do you mean? I've got my Elsa organizer with me, so let it snow. <laughs> oh, right. See you next time, guys. Hmm, interesting. Uh, getting even more interesting. Oh, okay, enough now. What's going on, Sam? Did you declare war on our stationery? No, Sue, I want you to marvel at our pet creations. You're saying Cookie did it? Cookie and Fluffy and even Tater Tots. Yeah, well, their taste is kind of weird. Until our stationery has a solid fortress, they'll just keep stealing everything. Fortress? Well, I can't promise to build a fortress, but we can definitely make a good house for our stationery. Something's coming! Hey, guys! Today we're going to make a real house for all the stationery. These are the parts we prepared. So far, it doesn't look like a house one would like to live in. <laughs> well, it'll take some time. First, we glue the back wall of the house to the base carefully. Okay. The first wall now. And the second one. Any better? Well, wow. Hmm. I can make out the outlines of the house already, but we need a roof. We'll get right on it. I prepared the parts we need here. Sure, or else Cookie would easily crush your cabaret house without a roof. We just have to be careful here so that the roof and the house become one. There, it worked just great. Hmm, time for some interior design. I prepared shelves for our house. Let's glue them. How will we know how high we should glue the cardboard shelf? Well, here's a pencil holder for you. What should you do with it? Draw our portrait. Uh, sure, as soon as we finish everything here. Look, we put the pencil holder with the stationery on the base. But there's space left both on top and on the side. Right, so we'll mark where we'll glue our shelf. And this spot here will perfectly match the pencil holder. And I'll go make more holders like this. <laughs> Great, Sammy. And I'll glue our first shelf in the meantime. You mean the first floor ceiling, Sue, don't ya? Oh, well, yeah, sure, Sam. And this will be the attic floor, then. Uh, what's this? This is, um, a lobby. All the tenants need to enter someplace, right? Huh, makes sense. Uh, what's with the front part, though? Won't there be a door? Of course there will. Here. Then you'll need this. Right. Cardboard master. <laughs> so... Done! Good job! The master approves! Oh, thank you, Sammy. Now we should glue ledges to our door. What should I do? 
Make a hinge for the door. Can you do that? You bet I can. The ledges are thin, so it's better to use a small amount of glue here. Easy, does it? The front part of the house is ready. We only need to attach it now. Here you go. Oh, great, Sammy. You used a pipe and a stick to make a hinge? Uh-huh. <laughs> Let's see how they work. After I glue them right here. There's no way they don't work. They were made by the master. Oh, I didn't doubt you, Sammy. We'll have the best dictionary house because I managed the construction. <laughs> That's right. Guess what? Our door will have a secret. Look. It reminds me of something. It does? What? I'll have to think about it. Do think. Oh, I know! We made the marker pen compartment in the same way for our other organizer. That's right, Sammy. Also, we used this back then. Remember? Huh. It wasn't part of the draft. <laughs> what draft? In a word, we'll use this to make a lock for our house. Really? This lock doesn't look reliable, Sue. It's too early to draw conclusions, Sam. We're about to have an awesome clasp here. Huh. It's actually working out just fine. You're right. Now our stationery is well protected. Uh, uh, our house is kind of empty. We'll fix it, Sam. Let's quickly make a compartment with several sections for our pens and pencils. We'll have so many sections here. Yeah, so that our house will be in perfect order. Ready! Oh, oh, I've got so many ideas now! I'm off to create! <laughs> okay, Sammy. In the meantime, I'll continue working on the house. What house can there be without a chimney? I already made it with four identical pieces of cardboard, a cutter, and a ruler. Huh, maybe some presents will go down this chimney for Christmas? Same you marker pens? Hmm, maybe. So, what about those ideas of yours? Just a sec! First of all, this box. You can put all kinds of trifles in it and then stick it in the attic. Oh. Second of all, the pencil holders I promised. Huh. And a super duper secret compartment. <gasps> Wow, it's so cool. Only this part could use some decor. <gasps> How could I forget about the decor? I'll go quickly fix it. It's okay, Sammy. I already prepared everything for the house. Then I'll add some touches to this part and you'll do the same to the facade. Uh, I'll resort to magic. Wow, it's so cool, Sue. Wait, will the roof stay just like this without decoration? Don't worry, Sammy, I didn't forget about the roof. What I've done. Great, Sammy, you're right on time. We're about to move the tenants in. We'll put the notebook here. This section will go first. And we'll have erasers living here. Let them settle over here. We'll keep pencils and felt pens in these holders. Oh, they fit just perfectly! Here's the big compartment! The biggest uh, apartment in the house! <laughs> Great! We'll put it in its place. Don't forget about the glue, Sue. Let it live in the attic. Okay. And Sharpies will be living here. Awesome! Now our stationery is safe. So I came up with a tale about our house. Oh, surprise me. Once upon a time in a far off YouTube land, there lived Sue and Sam, who decided to make a wonderful house for the stationery. So then what? The house proved to be so beautiful that all their viewers built the same kind of house for themselves the next day. Wow, and the world got to be full of marvelous magic houses with stationery. 
Great, Sam. Let's hope that your tale will prove to be true and our efforts won't be wasted. We'll know it thanks to your likes and subscriptions. That's right. Subscribe to our channel, guys. Have a good day and bye-bye. Look at the board and pay attention. When the value of this variable... Mm. <laughs> I wouldn't be so bored in class. I'd find a thing or two to do. Ugh, I'm not sleeping. Hey, wake up. <clears throat> Just listen to that slime. Uh-huh. Yeah, can you come up with something interesting, huh? What? We can do everything. And we'll prove it to you right now. I doubt it. No one is more creative than me. <laughs> we'll see about that. <laughs> Beware and behold. We're getting started. <laughs> hmm. Let's see what we have here. Uh huh. Huh. Let's start with this thing. What can we turn this into? Hey, Jack, catch. Hmm? Oh. Uh, on it. We'll get right to the spot and draw Professor Rick on this thing. <laughs> and Sam's wig from earlier today will be my reference for the professor's famous hairdo. <laughs> Hop. Hop. Our professor needs a couple of ears, too. So serious. Here comes the eyes. The bigger they are, the more he sees. Just a couple more details and everything is ready. Wait, it won't last long like this. Let's bake it using this super flashlight. It's alive! Alive! So, what do we have here? Everything's dry and firm. It turned out great. Now it's time to take care of the coloring stage. Hmm, we're getting a real and a bit crazy, Rick. <laughs> I'll secure everything with glossy varnish, and it's done! So, who's bored at the lessons now? Oh. <sighs> Isn't it a masterpiece? Yay! Uh, yeah. We're the best! <laughs> <laughs> You're busted! I want to know right now, who's doing chemical experiments here, huh? I see everything. <laughs> oh, nothing's happened here. Ah, the wind is blowing me away! Uh, um, it's all right. No chemical experiments, see? We're just writing in our notebooks, and this is just a pen cup. We, we did nothing bad, really. Mm. Oh, yeah? Hmm. Maybe that fog was coming from the outside. All right. But I'm watching you. Phew. That was close. Hey, want to see what I came up with? Here's the trick. We'll paint these pieces into bright colors. Here are some more. Snap. And now we'll attach the parts to a suitable surface. Mm -hmm. ah. <laughs> Look, you need to work carefully with the glue gun. Let's speed up a little. Oh. We'll cover it with a lid, and our staple box is ready. Huh? What should I do with this? Hmm, actually, this bottle cap can finalize the overall look. Perfect fit. What you doing? <laughs> oh, we have a spy here. Stay put. <laughs> hey, let me out! Freedom to super slime! Okay, okay, come out. But be quiet, or the teacher will see you. <laughs> Now our paper clips will stay in one place. Seriously? You don't think that someone will keep trying to steal them? Whoop! 
Huh? <clears throat> hey, what are you flying at? What is that noise? You're in class, young man. Yes, yes, sorry. Do you need a paper clip? You can have some. A paper clip? No, I don't need it now. And you keep quiet. I have an idea on how to transform a marker. Let's do it in a Pickle Rick style. And the face is ready. Check this out. See, it's a green marker. Very convenient. But we're not done yet. Let's make the whole thing brighter using acrylic paints. Now let's test it. <laughs> the teacher will be amazed. Let me see that. Hey, I want to add some details here. That's a good use of this marker. Oh, oh hey, <laughs> give it back. I well, made I it. Drew better. Yeah. Give it uh, to me. Uh, uh, no. It's mine. Uh, 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 Wake up! Huh? Your students are not huh? behaving! What are you doing? Stop it right now! Oops. We didn't Sorry, mean that. teach. <laughs> I'm amazingly smart and incredibly sly! <laughs> No way! The victory will be ours! Hm. We're gonna prove that to you right now! This eraser is too big! Let's shrink it! Like this! Now we can attach it to the pencil base! Let's add some foil! Just wrap it around this way! The arms and the leg pieces are already prepared! We'll speed it up! Let's paint it now and we can set our new friend free! We'll add some details to the face! So cool! So Sammy, can you stand against this one? What is going on there? No toys allowed in class! Don't you know that? It's not a toy, it's a new student, Pennsylvester, see? Don't take it out again! I got it. No more toys. I'll put it away. Don't be upset, buddy. I have an idea. And also, I have this mat. Check this out. Uh, oh, <laughs> First, we need to cover it with a layer of acrylic paint. Let's transfer this image. Up and done. It's so flexible. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what a great table. Huh? Oh, what a great mat! I'll keep it as a punishment for you. What? Oh no! <laughs> Don't worry, man. I have more ideas. Hmm, this mat feels really nice. I like it. Oh, how comfortable. <laughs> keep quiet, you two. Hey, Jack. Check out this cool blaster I've made. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Now we'll show Sam who's the boss here. Come on. <laughs> You won't catch me, try if you dare! <laughs> What's going on? Why aren't you two at your desks? Oh, oh. Um, mm. nothing's happening! Mm. I'm just gonna clear the board! Look! I'll make it look nice and shiny in a mere second! See for yourself! Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Huh? Okay, okay. Let me have that thing. And now go back to your seat. Ugh, so close. What? What are you up to, buddy? Just give me a second. Huh? Oh, I need this. All done. We'll keep here all our pens, pencils, and markers. Plumus makes everything easier. 
We'll cover it with the lid, and no one will find our things. <laughs> wow. It came out great. You're a genius. What are you doing here? Nothing special, ma'am. Then what is this thing? Just a box for pens and other small things. Huh? <gasps> ah! Help! Help me, it's a mouse! Huh? What is she talking about? Hey, look! Hmm? Oh. Ew, this is gross. Ah! <laughs> I put it there. I'm so smart. And still, <laughs> we're cooler than you. Look at all this stuff we've made. Yeah, let's Am check I right? out our masterpieces. <laughs> 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 So, oh, Sam, are you going to say that we are boring again? No, but I will take this thing as a compensation. But hey, give it back, would you? We didn't agree on that, so go away. But, uh, we won that creativity away. contest. <laughs> what is this? Why did you use my character without permission? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> they bought it. I'm the most creative here, and I will take all of these crafts. I need them more. Bye-bye. <laughs> the school day starts with a confrontation? What's going on? My doll is the best. Seriously, she can't compare to Barbie. Hmm, I wonder how will they solve this argument? Hard choice. Remove the toys and cell phones. They're not allowed in class. The girls are unhappy, but something tells me this is not the end. I'll prove to you that LOL dolls are the best. We'll make something super cool. Huh. You need glitter to be super cool. You know that. Oh, I asked not to call me during the class. Your phone's got hot from calls. Let's make a use of it. And now the most important thing. Making her beautiful. I love it. How oh, I know how to make things even cooler. <laughs> hmm. I wonder what she's up to. What? Conjuring something? And now we'll mix everything properly. Great job. Look at this variety of colors. My turn. I'm a super cool hairdresser for LOL dolls. Oh, so confident. I should check out her salon sometime. So cool. <laughs> What's that noise? Huh? Who is playing back there? Whoops. The teacher is not happy. I'm just drawing a color chart here. All right, but I'm watching you too. Ew, you were lucky, girls. <laughs> You have a drawing on your forehead. Ha, <laughs> see for yourself. Hey, you, do the blackboard. Uh, but I didn't do anything wrong. That'll show you how to laugh at me. Uh-oh, someone didn't take the bottle to the trash can and the Barbie lover stumbled over it. But she didn't get upset. Looks like it gave her an idea. It's great that I didn't forget my favorite marker. It'll really come in handy here. Oh, thanks. Cover me while I create. Yeah, creativity's at its peak here. Whoops. Don't make a noise. The teacher didn't seem to notice you. Keep going. We will connect these two parts. And the car is half ready. A car? <laughs> but it doesn't ride at all. It needs wheels. Let me put regular plastic straws in here to make them. Hold on. I still haven't finished the trunk for pens and pencils. Hey, that's not how it works. Now we're talking. And I have something in store. My favorite pink color. Isn't it a great idea? <laughs> now this car lets a bumper and a couple of headlights. Both front and back. Huh? Oh, here you go. 
The girls are working together. Isn't it great? Here are the wheels you were worried about. Only one so far. Put it in here and the car will ride at the speed of light. Not yet. Now it definitely will. Oh, we're gonna know exactly whose car it is. <laughs> but pens and pencils and other small things will ride on it. How do you like our Barbie car? Nice, but slow. Then let's speed up. Oh, my feta, the car is about to crash. <gasps> or the teacher will just take it away. Uh-oh. What a car. I'll keep it for myself. Just look how the teacher liked it. The girls are laughing. <laughs> they got an easy way out. Where is she? Uh-huh. Hiding from me as usual. Why don't we attach her to an elastic band? Here. Seems like a great idea. What's next? I have a cool thing. A magnetic button. Girls are like magnets themselves. They're attracted, then rip out. Drum roll. It worked. Now I have a zipper bracelet. Pretty. I can wear it how I want. And now a wow doll is always at hand. <laughs> no way. Toys are not allowed in the classroom. Uh, uh, it's just a hair accessory. Mm, okay, but no toys. <sighs> that was close. But we must not forget that we're at school. Now it's a geography lesson. Whoops, you should have been careful with this globe. It breaks easily. Here, take it. Glue it quickly while no one sees. Forget it! I have a better idea. They both seem to have one favorite color, pink. <laughs> At least they agreed on this. Oh, I want to be a part of this too. I have some felt. And she knows exactly what to do with it. Something is already happening. Look how beautiful it turned out. I like it. And I'm making a soft pillow. It'll match the glow perfectly. We only need to trim the edges a little bit. Looks like someone decided to give her an eternal flower. Oh, there's no smell. But it's quite suitable for a decor. I will help you. This will make it easier to secure everything. Thank you. And now the final stage. To put it all together. And Dal will be comfortable with such a pillow. Well done, girls. Be proud of yourself. Attention! Look at the map. What are you doing there? Uh, we're looking for a country on the globe. And also we're playing with the doll. Oh, I'd like to swing like that too. Oh, I know. What? A secret admirer again? Enough! No more artificial flowers! Look what I've got. And the teacher won't see. Now I'll show you a very cool dress. Where was it? It'll be easier this way. We'd better turn it into a closet altogether. We'll defo succeed. Everything we need is at hand. I'll make the shelves then. Here's one. And some magic, abracadabra, and done. Hey, be careful. Don't get carried away with your tricks. We have a lot to do. What does she have in her pencil case? <gasps> it's a Barbie silhouette. This is the best decoration for such a closet. Deserves a thumbs up. And it needs a special handle. How cute. I know. Barbie needs a hanger. Now I only need to put it all together. It's much more convenient now. There's a place for everything in here. Barbie wants to check it out. <gasps> I think she likes it. We can't do without Barbie's approval. Hmm, she looks at the shelves, at the door. Cool. Well done, girls. Great job. <gasps> oh no, my ring has bent. Now I can't wear it. Hey, don't throw it away. It will still come in handy. We just need to change its shape a little. It doesn't look like a ring this way. What will it be? Maybe you can use these as well. Easily. Let's make a crown. Just glue them on top. But we need to strengthen it so it doesn't fall apart. Clay is great. I will help you. My worm strengthens everything. <laughs> also, I can paint it. And quite well. Look. I can do tricks as well. The paint is dry. By the way, I want to draw something else. Let's complete it with windows with black paint. Whoa, it's the perfect crown for an LOL doll. It remains only to grow her hair. Can't do without them, right? I told you I'm a cool hairdresser. <laughs> an outfit is just as much important. Let's cut this air balloon a little. Funny distribution of duties. One cuts, the other one puts on. Working together comes out great. Oh, they show more tricks. Cool. Our LOL statue should have a shining torch. So real. I love how everything turns out. Here's a perfect stand. Well, that's it. Super completion of the process. <gasps> Looks like they want to add more details. The mini Statue of Liberty is in for an entourage. Uh-oh, uh, what are we doing here, huh? 
The geography lesson is already over, and I'll take this with me. Hmm. But the girls tried so hard. What a cool statue. She reminded me. Ah, oh, stop. It's the lesson now. The LOL doll was taken away. But I still have Barbie. <gasps> Ew, gum! Look at this. My Barbie is ruined. Now panic. We'll fix everything. Cut, cut. And done. Here, there's no gum now. My Barbie. It's awful. I'll save you. I'll rub some cream on your head. You don't have to save her. I just started. Let's give her a new haircut. Look. Whoa, what an amazing hairstyle! Told ya! There you go! Well, well, are you playing again? Uh, no. This is my new razor, see? Okay, I believe you this time. The girls are top notch. <laughs> so much has been done today. lesson is coming to an end. Everyone is tired. <laughs> and the teacher has no intention of parting with LOL doll. It's because LOL dolls are the best! So many cracks with her! Barbie is much cooler, and taller, and brighter. Oh, this debate could last forever. <laughs> Subscribe to our channel and see you soon! Holy cannoli, Sue! What's up, Sam? Did you forget? It's my first day at the cool slime and I have nothing ready! I was looking for my backpack, but I found only this purse. Hmm, these won't fit into it anyway. So now I'm gonna have to carry all this stuff all day? Hmm, yeah, that's not very convenient. Wait a second, I have an idea. Come on. Hey guys, today we're gonna make a school locker organizer for our Sammy. We'll start with the locker itself, and then we'll add some useful things to it. I'm ready to build anything, even the school itself, and you can go there with me. Why don't we start with the foam board? Easy peasy. One hit and we'll get it done. Ha! I don't need any tools for that. hi -ya! Sam, what are you doing? Showing off my karate skills, of course. Call me if you need anything else to be done in no time. Will do. You know that I can do nothing without you. Later, I'm gonna need your help again. Now we should put these pieces together with the help of this. I know you, glue gun. You're dangerous. I'll fight you. Just let me get my sword first. Don't worry, Sammy. I'll be careful, and it won't hurt me. Ah, just when I was in the right mood. All right, then I'll bring you more pieces for the locker. That's your best decision ever. <laughs> and the base for our locker is done. A bit more glue. Uh, no offense, but a white locker is boring. No kidding. Well, of course. I'm sure we'll come up with something. Hop. See, our locker definitely needs a shelf inside. Here, take this. Oh, great. But before we put it in its place, let's come up with some decor. If you ask me, it should be pink. I just need to find the right shade. Should it be light pink or pinkish pink? Hmm. That's tough. Guys, while Sammy's thinking, give us a thumbs up and stay tuned. The best part is yet to come. Phew, there are so many colors that I like. I think I'm lost without your help. Oh, this one suits you so well. But this sheet is too big. Let's work on it a bit. Come on, Sue. That will take you forever. Let's use some magic. You're a genius. I know I am. Let's get to it. That's better. Now we have everything that we need. Yay! It's time to start my favorite part of any craft. Guys, we're almost done. Just one step left. Dude, check it out! I prepared this for you. 
Wow, I really like these stripes. Let's glue it right now. That means my locker's already done? <gasps> Wait a second. Where did I put it? Sue, can you help me find that piece? You mean this? Yeah! And the shelf goes right here. Sue, I just noticed that we missed a spot here. No, we didn't. <laughs> ah, I got it! Here, Sue! Thanks, Sam. You read my mind. Guys, we need to mount the door and hide the tape behind the panel. Just don't rush at this step. But it's so hard! Sue, I can't wait to get my organizer ready! Can you just use magic again? We can't use magic all the time, Sammy. Then I'll go and make something for the craft, too. Speed things up a notch! I'm sure you can use these. Hmm, let me see. You're right. Guys, can you guess what this is? Now our foam board locker really looks like the real deal. You don't say. Do you like it, guys? Or should we add something else? We didn't use this pretty paper and I like it so much. Why don't we put it on the inner side of the door? That's brilliant. Like a dream come true. Oh, I already see how I'm going to fill it up. We need a handle. A handle? That I can do. I will do my best, I promise. You know, Samuel the Great can do anything. Uh, wait, where was I going? To my room to bring me a gift baggie. Do you mean this one? But why do you need it? Is it for me? Sammy, it's not a gift. It's just there's some stuff for the locker in there. Like this, to make sure that you always look great. So it's not just stuff, Susie. These are super fun things for our locker. The bag itself will go right here. That looks good. Could you put some stickers here as well? Will this place be good? Shiver me chatters, it's terrific! Here comes one more touch. <gasps> Sue, I've just realized that I didn't bring you that handle that I promised! Don't worry, Sammy. It's right here. Great! We finished our school organizer. Let's see what we can put inside it. I can't choose only one sticker out of all of these! Don't worry, Sammy. I know exactly what to do. How do you like it? Shiver me! How come I didn't come up with that? What's next on the list? Something to put in here. Hmm, I need a second. I have them somewhere. Aha! These guys are coming with me! Isn't it the best place for my pens and pencils? Well, Sammy, do you like it? I super like it. But we might need some kind of drawers for smaller things. Oh, I think I know. We'll use these to solve the problem. Sam, I need some colored paper. Here it is, my lady. What are you up to? Watch me, but I'm gonna go with craft magic for this. Great, that's more like it. Guys, remember that you may use any colors you want. By the way, this is not our first organizer, people. You can check out our channel for more! How is that going, Sue? See for yourself. Well, 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 I like these colors. You may proceed. And this is it. Now they are glued together. I think we need to envelop that whole construction with this nice colored paper. Hmm. This side will match better. But how will we open them? I have several beads here. Maybe we can use them somehow? Let's see, we'll glue them here. Yep, these are perfect. Hurry up, Sue! My school day's about to begin and we still have a few things to do. Whoa! Be cool, Sammy. We're almost there. Every student eats their notebooks. Let's make some. Traditional shape is not for us. Our notebooks will be round. Good macaroons! Sue, give me that cup! I want to draw some nice circles, too. <laughs> But this might take a while. Should we use some magic then? Up. 
Our circles are ready. You also need this, Sue. Wait, there's more. Here you go, Sue. Thank you, Sammy. You are very kind. We just need to cut them out. Voila! Now they are perfect. Guys, did you know that foam paper is an interesting material that changes if you heat it up? But you must be very attentive and careful working with it. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> they look like hats! I should have one in the organizer for the school's official event. If you say so, but I thought you had plenty of hats. Not like that one. Schools have rules and about hats as well. Now give me some room! The artiste is working! All done! <laughs> this is awesome, Sammy! We'll put it right here! And this one goes here! But I have one more idea for a notebook of an interesting shape! Sam the Magician will help you get what you want! No thanks, I'm good actually! Oh, I didn't see that coming! And keep working, and I have some urgent things to do. See ya! This notebook will come with a surprise. Simple dimple style. There you go. Nobody has a school locker like this. What a great organizer! Now my new notebook is always at hand! Phew! My books are too heavy! I'll put them in here for a while! Ah, that's better! No, no, Sammy! That's the locker for my thing! But Sue! We were making that organizer for me! Sorry, Sammy! It turned out so cool I couldn't resist! Don't worry! Next time we will make a wonderful organizer for you! Right, guys? Ah, deal! We hope that you will join us then, guys! See you soon! Bye-bye! Okay, Sammy. You're gonna need a pen and a pencil. What else? I don't want to study. But you need to train your brain. Moreover, learning new things is always so exciting. Boring! It's so boring to write on very boring topics in boring notebooks and boring pens! Ah, now I see. Let's add some fun to learning with cute stationery. Come on! Hi, guys! Today we're gonna make Hawaii school supplies! To make your school days more interesting and fun! That's right! Now, what should we begin with? Since you've already bought this notebook, maybe we can start with it? Great idea, Sammy! But first, preparation! Okay! We need to choose nice and soft fabric. I've already transferred the outlines of all the pieces and now we need to cut them out! I guess we need scissors for this! Right! Always be careful with them, guys! For this craft, we need to make four paws and two ears. Each piece consists of two pieces which we are going to sew together from the back side and then turn inside out. Oh, it will take forever! I can show you how to do this. What do you think? Sure! I even brought this pretty thread for you! Thanks! And here's the needle! Guys, don't forget about safety while working with sharp objects. Needles are not toys! Or feel free to ask an adult to help you at this stage. You don't need the scissors anymore, am I right? No, 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 I'll need them in a sec. What for? We've already cut out everything! Yes, but the scissors can be used in many ways. For example, for turning the piece inside out. Ah, now I get it! So clever! Let's talk more work, Sammy. Huh? Wow, looks so cool! Uh, I've almost done too! Now we'll open the very last page to glue our pieces like this. 
Guys, safety comes first, so be very careful with the glue gun. Phew! Phew, I finished my part of the work! Finally! Guys, I hope you don't mind a little bit of craft magic. Wow! How do you like it? Phew, it's amazing! But I was thinking, maybe we can figure out how to close it tightly? I don't want everybody to see my drawings! You were wearing the solution on your forehead all this time! Huh? Yeah, that's what I meant! <laughs> Hmm, something is missing. Hup, now we're talking. Sue, I was working on a project too. Promise not to laugh. Wow, Sammy, you did a great job. Yay, thanks, Sue. Let's test it. There is no notebook without a bookmark. You're right. When you study, you can't waste a minute to search where you finished your notes. Hup, it worked. Guys, you would be surprised how easy it is. You can draw any animal you want. By the way, Sammy. Yeah, I'm here. You said something about your drawings. I think it's time to show off your art skills. I can do it even with my eyes closed. We will see. Oh, and one more thing. Can you please keep the bear theme so the bookmarks are in one style? I'm sure you'll make a cool bear. There are so many of them. Guys, we need to make two openings here. But don't forget about being very careful while working with the cutter. Sue, try to guess what bear I'm making? Hmm, according to the white color, it can be... The polar bear! Am I right? No, <laughs> but you're lucky to have one more guess. Sammy, maybe you can just show us what you've got there? It's a panda! Guys, give us a thumbs up if you guess that! What about taking another look at our pretty set? What are you doing, Sue? Don't answer! I'll figure that out! Well, well, well! Two tiny stars! And a kind of... Sammy, I can't see anything! So do you have any idea what it is? Maybe it's a brooch? Did you forget we're making school supplies today? Not accessories! Sue, don't keep us in suspense! It's the cutest paper clip ever! Pay attention, guys! You need to attach a clip to the fabric, not just put it in. As for me, it's not kawaii enough. But if we add some more details... What about some sprinkles? Our star is gonna look like a cupcake! Like this one? Oh, Sammy, I can see you have nothing to do. I wish someone could make another paper clip. Sue, why do you need someone when you have a slime like me? <laughs> it's so easy to trick you. Ask an adult to help you at this stage if you want. And the last touch. I haven't heard Sammy for ages. Where is he? Sammy? I'm here with a bunny clip. Oh, guys, would you look at these cuties? something else. We just need to stuff it. Guys, we've already made so many school crafts. Subscribe to our channel if you want to watch them all. Now we can fill this piece up this way. And a little bit more to the other one. Oh, it's so exciting to watch you turn a plain piece of fabric into a pretty cute craft. It makes me thirsty. Hey, it's empty. Don't throw that can away, Sammy. And check out these little eyes. A can? But it's empty! Yes, it is. But we're trying to recycle as much as we can, remember? It's very important for our environment. Because if we're not going to do this, who will? Yeah, you're right. There are so many of us, but there's only one planet Earth. That's exactly what I was talking about. Now, a little more sewing. Sue, 
we can also use this juice straw! Sammy, can you please make the legs from it? Who's the fastest crafter in the world? You are, of course! Just in time! And the final touch! Yay! Now we're talking! Check out these cute legs! Sue, don't take it personal, but I can't understand what animal that is! It's a cute little lamb, see? He is so sweet, Sue! Guys, let's have a closer look at him! Guys, we're back! This time, I've decided to work on the eraser! Sue, check out this old beauty blender! What a color! Maybe we can use it! Here I go! Oh, I'm so sorry! Now it's ruined! Hey, Sammy, don't worry! I was gonna cut that anyway! A bit of magic? Snap! Check this out, guys! And the last touch to make it much more kawaii! We need the maximum of kawaii for this craft! And we've got it! <laughs> Guys, this is gonna be our last craft for today! That's why you asked for so many sparkling details! And while I'm busy here, can you glue them? Sure thing! We need to figure out the way to close our unusual binder. This time, instead of Velcro, we'll use magnets. Here we go! Looking good! How long should I wait for you, Sue? I'm already done! Huh? It looks like you enjoyed making this! Check out this cute little buddy, guys! Let's give him his paws! One goes here. And another one goes right here. Like this. Now we can close our binder. Oh, guys, look! If the binder is closed, it seems like our raccoon is closing his eyes! Like he's playing hide and seek! It's too cute to be true! Let's look at all of our crafts one more time! <laughs> I can see you've changed your mind about studying! <laughs> of course! With stationery like this, any lesson will turn into a great experience! Guys, if you liked our crafts today as much as I do, give us a thumbs up! Don't forget to hit the bell button so you don't miss our next video! And subscribe to our channel! Bye-bye!